A structure is externally unstable when it can move, rotate, or collapse if an external force is applied to it. Although they seem unuseful, we need these structures in our lives. Let's consider a structure with two roller supports. If we apply the force to it, it will move. So, it's unstable. In mathematical terms, if we look at the stability equation, it has two reactions and two minus three is a negative one. As this value is less than zero, hence the structure is unstable. Now, let's get to a real life example. The most common structure used to lift factory items is an overhead traveling crane on an eye girder. It moves when forces is applied to it and helps in moving load from one point to another. Looking at this structure closely, it consists of single or multiple roller supports, as we looked at earlier, and hence it is unstable structure, but useful for moving heavy items. Let's look at another commonly used structure, a weighing machine. It has hinge support at the center, with equivalent frames at both ends. Again, if we look at the stability equation, it has two reactions, and two minus three is a negative one. As this value is less than zero, hence the structure is unstable. If load is applied to one end, it gets unstable, but we want it to behave this way as it is necessary for it to work properly so that we can measure the weight of the item by putting counterweights at another end to balance the moments. Many other examples include doors, seismographs for recording earthquakes, and more that we might discuss in our future videos in detail. Please check our channel for more videos like these or feel free to ask any questions in the comment section below.